There is a super easy and quick way of creating dynamic captions for your videos to make them more engaging and accessible. The script does automatic transcription and lets you customize your captions so they stand out. Open the script application on your computer or in the browser and add a new project. I am going to add a new video file, which is a vertical short that I am currently working on. Once you upload your video, the script will start transcribing it. You can specify who is the speaker in the video. First, I'm going to fill my canvas so the video fits the screen. While the script is working on my transcript, I will unhide my timeline at the bottom. I like to zoom out to see my entire timeline. Now my transcription has been done and I can test it by going to the front of my video and pressing play or the spacebar on my keyboard. To add captions, you can make a text selection or select all by pressing the command or control plus A on your keyboard. Then I'm going to select the text option at the top and choose captions. A captions track has been added to my timeline and captions with the settings from my previous project. I can easily make changes and customize my captions by selecting them on the right. Under style, you have three default options. Karaoke style, which is my favorite, has a dark text with white text over blue background. The classic style is just a plain black text. And the clean style are black and white captions. Whichever style you select, you are able to customize it. The fill option at the top is for the color of the text that has already been set. Future Words customizes the look of upcoming words. And you can also emphasize the current word being spoken by customizing the active word feature. With active word, you can select the color of the text and the background. Test out different combinations against your video's background and select the one that is most readable. Let's test out our dynamic captions. That looks pretty good. But at any point, I can still go back and change the look of them. Another thing you have a control of is the position of the captions. You can grab the text box and move it on your screen. However, when I do that, at one point, the captions are blocking my video. If you want to have different position for your captions, you have to split the captions in the timeline. Select the point where you want to split it and press the letter S. Now I'm able to select different placements for the captions at the beginning and end of my video. And you can do that multiple times. Another thing you can control is the maximum lines of text that show up at one time. I can enlarge the text box to show more text or make it narrow for one caption line at a time. You can also customize the style of your font and size, how it is aligned, and whether it is capitalized. Last thing left is to test out our captions. Thanks so much for watching.